everyone, today I want to tell you about my first visit at the vet and how I was dealing with my vaccination afterwards. We are very lucky that the vet is very close to us and it's just like a 5 to 10 minutes walk. So my parents and I walked there and as you can see my sweater is getting kind of too small for me. But since my parents don't really know how big I'm gonna get, they didn't buy me a new one yet so we have to get one at some point. Um, but when we arrived at the vet, my parents realized that my mom noted the wrong date in the calendar and we actually needed to come back the next day. That has never happened to her before. But like that, I already got to know the clinic and got to know the place and everything was kind of fine there and I felt comfortable because I always love other people and other dogs, so that was fine. So we came back the next day at the same time and at first my doctor had to weigh me. And I'm already weighing three kilograms, so that's a little bit too much for a toy poodle. So the vet thinks that I'm going to get a little bit taller than a toy poodle because I'm already kind of tall, but I don't weigh too much. So my parents can actually feed me a little bit more. And then I got checked for my teeth, my heart, my paws, etc. So everything got checked and everything's very fine and I'm doing well and I'm developing well. So that's a win and we're very happy about that, of course. And then the vet distracted me with some snacks and of course I loved that but I really really hated it when she vaccinated me and I was crying a lot and I didn't like it at all and the snacks could barely distract me and couldn't really make up for it and the vet really told my parents that I'm a quite sensitive puppy and I'm sensitive to pain but I'm also a drama queen because I was crying a lot and she gave my parents the tip that they should just like ignore my crying because if they would pity me and feel sorry for me then I would think that really something bad has happened to me and I would cry even more because then I know I would get their attention and we of course do not want that and that was a very good tip and my parents listened to it and actually it was only bad during the first afternoon and evening and I was crying a lot when my parents tried to pick me up to go potty but the next day it was already so much better and I couldn't even feel a thing anymore. So my parents are already kind of excited to see whether I will remember the pain or the snacks next time that we go to the vet. So that was my first time at the vet. Everything was going kind of well and I'm healthy so that's all that matters. And if you want to follow my journey I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and like this video and then we'll see each other next time. Bye-bye.